Welcome to the Trump Breaking News Network, your daily source for up to the minute Trump news. Join us today and every day. Here's today's news. This is TBNN. Nasty Trump basher insists he's innocent in Golden Shower scandal, but look what he tweeted out last March. By Jim Hoft. So who is Rick Wilson? Rick is a GOP consultant who hates Trump. He attacked and smeared several Trump supporters all year long. His attacks were personal, disgusting and hateful. Because of his Trump bashing he was frequently invited on CNN and MSNBC to bash the Republican president-elect. Here is more on Rick Wilson. On Tuesday the Gateway Pundit broke the story that liberal media outlets and the CIA fell for an incredible golden shower fable about Donald Trump that was created by 4chan newsers. BuzzFeed, Cosmopolitan, and CNN got played by 4chan. Rick Wilson got a special mention. According to the leaked intelligence documents, Trump disliked Obama so much that he hired two Russian hookers to piss on the bed that Obama slept on in Russia. And the liberal media ran with this. Seriously? The original story was created by 4chan user. According to 4chan these documents were created by a 4chan user and sent to anti-Trumper Rick Wilson knowing he would act on this tip. 4chan discussed this tonight. Political hacks emailed documents to hash and ever Trump jackass Rick Wilson about Trump making people piss on the bed. Rick Wilson thought it was real and gave it to leftists at the CIA. The CIA of the USA put this in their official classified intelligence report on Russian involvement in the U.S. election. Donald Trump and Obama were both given private sessions with the CIA to discuss this. The CIA concluded that the Russians planned to blackmail Trump with this story we made up. The 4chan users then linked to this. So they took what I told Rick Wilson and added a Russian spy angle to it. They still believe it. Guys, they're truly fucking desperate, there's no remaining Trump scandal that's credible. If these journalists were real journalists and not fake journalists then they would have found that the original documents did not conform to CIA or UK intelligence requirements. But they ran with it anyway. Today Rick Wilson denied he was involved with the Golden Shower documents. He posted several strange tweets on the subject. He still hates Trump. But a few months ago Rick Wilson tweeted this out. Mike Cernovich ain't buying it. John McCain turned the Golden Shower Fable documents over to the FBI. It is likely we know where he got them. That's the news. Join us here every day. Be sure to subscribe and click the bell. See you next time. This is TBNN.